Guys, got any fire extinguishers? He's going up. His cab's on fire. shot of that truck coming over that bridge right beautiful day out here and thanks to truck smarter we filled up for 260 a gallon stick around find out how are we getting some sausage and bacon okay all right bright-eyed bushy-tailed The egg quesadilla caught my eye, so I had to grab it. Okay, let's go eat. That's a good looking w Well, appreciate you taking me around, man. Awesome, we have our Uber and we are back at the trucks. Let's go fire up this big old girl. I left my APU running on battery tender mode, so my battery should be good to go. And we're gonna get over there. I guess they have a parade. They run around, the rest of the trucks kind of leaving in the morning. I never heard of that, but look at this puppy right here. <laughs> That's a big old puppy, pretty dog. All right, there's Sammy's truck. Let's get over to ours, get her fired up. So the APU is not running, so that means my batteries are charged. Um, it'll, if it drops below 12.5 volts, it'll kick on for two hours, which is an awesome feature. Let's fire. Oh yeah. Let's go. All right, she's warming up. Let's get over there. Sammy's truck is sleeping good next to us. those tanks just met Troy nice meeting you this morning man I'm glad you were out there when I saw you I'm trying to change my colors and my little whips all right she's filling up my there he is in the white or the black liver <laughs> I say see you later this guy he's pointing at me This is Wayne right here from Wisconsin, right? Yes, nice sir. Yeah, like, nice picture of that truck. I'm like, there yeah, you go. that's awesome. I'm sorry man. we didn't spend a lot of time out here, but we had so many dinners and obligations, but you can see it. that here. Cool, I man. get it. You too, man. Yeah, that was awesome meeting you, man. Jump out real quick and all right. Let's get going. Watch out for that mobile. Let him have the right of way.
It's showing, what happens, how cold is it? It's showing, my lights are on, so it's not showing my dash. 45 degrees. Woo. Not too bad. Not. I think it was in the 30s last year. Got a puppy dog barking at the window right there. Let's turn and burn. playing with the dog or trying to get the dog <laughs> he's got a stick and he's running away from him <laughs> knows what he's doing okay so coming into gate four uh green a view should be right over here I brought the uh, Suburban on the back. <laughs> there you go. I'll enclose trailer for that. So they, they just uh they canceled it this morning huh yeah okay so they did cancel the uh parade but they actually do have one every morning uh this sunday leaving but um canceled it, so they're gonna make their own little one and they're lining up so let's fall in line
He's going up. His cab's on fire. Got another one. Stay it out. Go, 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 go. Oh, oh guys, I think they're going to save it, but man. Like it started up top, or maybe it was just going back in there. Jeez, he's lucky it didn't go all the way down. Woo. I would be too. Fixed, yeah. so I don't worry about that. Yeah. That was my ride home. Prayers for that guy, guys. He's at a college station. We're trying to, a couple guys are already trying to put an RGN together for him to get him home, but he has to get the kind of Stoga home too. <sighs> Blessings and prayers for that, for that guy. We gotta get our truck out of the road though. We're blocking. <sighs> Helping you can, guys. Trucking, it's a, it's a family community, and I definitely got my exercise in. <laughs> But it's a blessing it didn't go all the way to the ground. Well, we gotta get another fire extinguisher. That's a sad ending for it. <laughs> the little kid had his hand going up and down, so gotta, gotta run it for him, you know? Hey, and good old W9 was close to Orwell. There you go. See you later, Orwell. for him guys he's got to get home to college station and up here on the right we got Amsoil Adam getting some good footage man I'll wave the other way out and hopefully you see this video man appreciate it and I'll steal some of that footage from yours probably so don't 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 send me a copyright <laughs> thanks man we got that big truck with the big tires up there leading the pack that's kind of cool That's Amsoil Adam. Adam, we'll see you next year, buddy. Take care, man. All right, let's go. Yeah, I would like to see that big truck rolling. I'll, I'll watch a couple videos on it, I'm sure. Like that red and black. Beautiful little Camworth, man. Love that truck. Whoever owns it. But, uh, yeah, prayers for that Peterbilt, guys. The biggest thing is him getting home. That's going to be, uh, I mean, there's plenty of RGFs out here. Maybe somebody could help him out. If I have one, I'd definitely lend a hand. Um, yeah. Attempt number two. I'm glad everybody got there to help him with that situation. It could be anybody's truck. These trucks are, are machines, you know?
goes the goose, guys. I'm gonna go over here and uh, do a photo opportunity. Fire department showed up, uh, and this was the photo op I was taking. A lot of you guys were saying, where's Orwell? <laughs> there he is. Let's look, get a couple shots of these trucks rolling by, and then uh, go get T-dubs and get on going. Gorgeous trucks. As for the brown, our second stay, as good as the first. Loved it, so time to get going. Back to the truck and back home. All right, Orwell, we're out of here, buddy. Roll easy, man. Enjoy that green APU. Uh, it's nice meeting you and Tim uh, yesterday at Green APU, man. It was awesome. And uh, Green APU is actually talking about working with Tim because I think he has a green truck that would actually work pretty good with that green APU. So <laughs> that was pretty cool talking to him about him. Uh, saying that so all right let's keep going it's kind of getting cleared out you know it's getting settled in and Matt's 2023 appreciate you it's been great appreciate all you guys we met but now we roll out okay roll out, roll out. let's get some breakfast for this girl back here we haven't even ate this morning some just some coffee well, I have a little bit of coffee but she did not but it's cold man. all right let's go Simpsonville, South Carolina. Wouldn't it be nice if uh, Simpsonville, Kentucky was as close? <laughs> uh, Simpsonville, Kentucky's right here. Pretty crazy. That big water tower across the way says Simpsonville on it. Pretty funny. But there's a nice pilot right here. I stopped here once and got a breakfast sandwich. Forget where I was delivering to. I think I was delivering to Louisville. I don't know. But uh, man, Simpsonville, Kentucky. Just like Simpsonville, South Carolina probably. Eat up some breakfast and a coffee. And from out here, pump price is three or four forty-five. My goodness! With the Truck Smarter app, your first uh, fill-up using their uh, fuel system is a dollar off. So it was two sixty. So that is definitely going to be something we're going to do when we fuel up again. I don't need fuel. I'll get home on the fuel I have. But definitely next time I fuel up, that will be uh, be in play. So, one dollar off per gallon. That's crazy. Yeah, it's a busy truck stop. Got some guys parked uh, sideways right there, I guess. I don't know if that guy's delivering or just waking up, but it's not a great place to park there. Tyson, he's got his landing gear almost all the way down, too. Hmm. Who knows? 
Yeah, not a great big place and uh, definitely not a lot of parking. I think I came here last time and the uh, poor guy's W900 had his, his front bumper hit off. So let's get in here and try and get some food, but I don't want to block the fuel island, but it is really slow, but still, you never want to block the fuel island. I'll see if we see any parking spots over there. And speaking of Truck Smarter, if you're not already signed up with them, get signed up, guys. All kinds of great uh, benefits of having the app, and it's a free app. So it was awesome to meet Paulo, Dan, and all the people out there, especially Gary, too, the factory guy. So their factoring is only 2%, so that's at least a percent cheaper than the best you're going to find out there. So give them a check out if you are, already haven't. <laughs> what was your Bravo. name? Shimon Spencer. Nice to meet Houston, you, man. Texas. So I got a four-year-old. Three-year-old, almost two-year-old, and one on the way. Congrats, man! Well, you got a boy, girl already, or two boys, uh, a girl, and then the one is anonymous. Oh, anonymous. we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. That's awesome, man. Well, it was awesome meeting you. He was, you were actually parked next. To me. I might have had you on video this morning, popping your hood. Really? Yeah. No, so cool. Hey, I was doing a pre-trip. Like there you go. Time. He's doing his pre-trip. <laughs> and sorry, and he's uh, heading to South Carolina too. So we'll right. be rolling right next to you. Yes, nice meeting you, man. You well, I guess this is the best truck stop to stop at. Because Tim Jedge pulled up right next to us. That thing sounds mean. I didn't know it was an international. There we go. We're both heading back down. We said hi to them inside. Let's get home safe. Good seeing you, Tim. He was kind of parked off to the left and he just started moving. So I said, all right, I'll stop here. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that Volvo on the bottom, uh, right over there, that orange one next to the red freight liner, that's where uh, that other W9 last time I was here, he got his whole clip taken off. Just kind of a tight place to park. Not a lot of parking either. They, they got plenty of land though. They should have made this place huge. They should have made this place they huge. Made it huge. You got it, Roel. I'll give you a honk if you're gonna hit Century. Yeah, let's get home. I'm ready to see Turn the babies. Ready to see the babies. We got about six hours. We'll see them. We'll probably see them before, they, see them before <laughs> they go to bed or right when they're going to bed. We'll definitely see Kylan in the morning. We'll definitely get, uh, it's morning time. Mama, Mama, it's morning time. It's morning time. <laughs> He did FaceTime every, yeah, he uh, FaceTime every morning. Me. He just FaceTime me. Did right now? Yeah, With I Mama? missed it. It's morning time. Oh, he's got a buddy came, that came out. Maybe he's training him. Or maybe they're running team. I don't know. But Spencer, man, it's cool meeting you, dude. He's like, uh, he, he gets bored with driving. He runs for Landstar. Yeah, so he, he's like, he I don't goes, like it. It's just boring. He goes, I want a briefer. It's exciting. And I, I got to like, check all kinds of stuff. I got to put like, fuel in the You got to check this, check that. I was like, dude, he was so... Awesome dude, you guy. are so awesome. Yeah, you're you awesome too, man. Nice talking with you today. <laughs> it was and, uh, so great <laughs> in pilot. They teach. They uh, so they used to uh, teach music. Yeah, Chris, and, his wife. Yeah. and he was like a DJ for the church for Christian rap and stuff. Christian hip hop. It's pretty cool. How cool. Pretty cool, Spencer. And he uh, and blessings on your new one coming, man. I hope you yes. get. Yeah. Hope you get it even it out. All those babies. Yeah. I love it. What Tell is your he? Wife, congratulations. Two boys and a girl, and he doesn't know about the, the one coming. It's anonymous. Nah, it's, I love it. He goes the <laughs> That's cool, man. Oh, All right. I love it. Well, Roel's almost done uh, getting it in there. He's got it. Luckily, he had two spots, so he's he's right in the middle of them. But he uh, had plenty of room to get back in there. I was gonna say he was really easy to talk to. Yeah, he's cool. He You're just really came up. He's like, "Hey, man, I was parked next to a Matt's. <laughs> I, like, I think I got you on film this morning, pulling your hood, man." <laughs> he's like, "Yeah, I'm doing my pre-trip for uh, Landstar, so that's cool." But he's talking about. Um, like owner financing that they have through Landstar. It's pretty cool to hear him talk about it. So he's going to get on YouTube right now. He's just on TikTok. But I said, hey, man, get on YouTube, bro. Make it worthwhile because uh, YouTube just started paying for like the shorts, which are TikToks pretty much. So that's why I do them every now and then. And he's actually behind us. I can see his truck. <laughs> All right, Roel. All right, I'm about to FaceTime you. Um, ignore it. All right, I think we're good now. There right, we go. We got it. Find the gear. Find the gear. Are they not going to go in for me? There we go. Oh, yeah, he's pulling the Landstar trail. I didn't see his trail away. He's parked next to me. And Tim got out already. <laughs> he must have just turned around right there. <laughs> he's right in front of us. Roll easy, guys. Hope you get home safe. Hope we do too. There goes Ginger right there, right in front of us. He's rolling not Tennessee, we're rolling Carolina. He's got like a four with a flatbed on the back of it. I didn't see that truck. They must have been using that to get back and forth. And we got Spencer behind us. 
this. <laughs> That's crazy. Tennessee. Every time, <laughs> man. Case in our middle and Kai, take it home. Tank was a big hit at Matt's. He, uh, more people ask about him than us. <laughs> we love Tank. Like, yeah, yeah, that's too. Not mo most of the time we do, but he's been FaceTiming me literally all day. <laughs> do you tell you it's morning time? Oh, Anyways, uh, Case loves cinnamon rolls, so we're gonna bring him a little bit of cinnamon buns. Oh yeah, let's go. Stay there. They probably should have just grabbed you some of that grass, but oh, yeah. But I, I hope 
hope everything's okay up here. Looks like we got some old Ferris wheels over here. An old rocket, but uh, it is definitely not moving. Not at all. Got a TA up here, but we just got done refreshing, so we're, we're, we're good to go. We just need to go. I guess the best thing about the slow and go is uh, we're going to pass that cool landmark in slow motion. Creeping by. Past the horse trailers are pretty tall. There's two of them in a row, so they were in the right lane. I, the first guy was getting over, and he was going to separate from the second, so I waited for him. Let him get over so they can ride together. Ride together. Can't see nothing though. It's opening up pretty big right here, and here's that monument I'm talking about. Pretty cool. We have been dead stop now for a bit. I mean, the right lanes are moving, but the left is uh, not moving at all. I don't know, it's been about five minutes, so that's a monument if we ever get up to it. We shall see. So we just went live, guys. There's a, a Prius and a Volkswagen trying to do the turnaround. And the thing about it is on that northbound side, there is no uh, crash or anything. Yeah, um, really it's just backed up. Here. So it, um, I think the crash was on our side. They said a, a flatbed flipped over. We did go live about it, but we didn't see any kind of, uh, any kind of uh, aftermath, so. They probably were just cleaning it up when we came through. But that northbound, unless there was a guy in the middle of the road. So that Spencer buddy of ours, that's actually his last name. Yeah, I don't know why this guy's driving the wrong way on the highway. Hopefully that's uh, uh, official of the, I don't know what's going on there. But there was this guy in the middle of the road, uh, and uh, his, our buddy Spencer just saw it because he's five miles behind us. He's like, hey, that guy's like an ambulance now. I'm like, what? Because he was in the middle of the highway. So check out that live feed if you missed it. But we're rolling again. Uh, hopefully we get smooth sailing now because we got less than 200 miles and we're back to these kids. So I'll bless you guys off. You got stuck in that 75 backup, but I didn't see anything. I was just backed up besides the guy in the middle of the road. Yeah, that's about it. Can we finally get to, oh, this guy just locked his brakes up. Come on, we're doing that. Go, go, here we go. I don't like when people lock the brakes up. I don't think anybody does. Oh, a guy in front has got a big old Argent, I believe. Uh, yeah, it's a step deck. Got some big owner, two big old containers pushed together. And we're heading the right direction. Almost halfway. Well, past halfway now, yeah. Rolling easy besides that backup up there. Jeez. 69 degrees now coming through here. Get on the 40.
I took the van lines for the beginning of this uh, video. T Dub is hungry though, so we're making great time. Besides that little hiccup back there with the stop, but we're gonna stop up here. There's some cows down there under the windmill, and we got a cattle hauler with some cows in it right in front of us. And 432, that is our exit we are taking because we're taking full advantage of uh, our $1 discount by Truck Smarter. It's exactly the same as you get on Mudflap, guys. You just add a credit card, as you can see right here on the left, and then you do the same thing, you reserve a code, and uh, we will see when we walk in there if the process is pretty identical to Mudflap and easy to use. But reserving a code, super easy. You enter your credit card information, and it said reserve a code. So they authenticated it, uh, authenticated it and said you're ready to go. So let's get the 432B and hit the fuel stop. Okay, here's 432. It said 432B, but there was just 432. So. There was no A or B. We're going across the, under the highway. But that's where the fuel stop is. Is this a double turn? It doesn't have arrows. It's the Honda Accord. It's going that way. Got to turn off my CB because I have that feedback. A lot of times, guys, if you're riding next to me and I don't have my CB on, I don't always keep it on. I weirdly got the green light. Um, it's because of the feedback from the lights. I shouldn't have lights on anyways. But what I do, we got the green arrow. Let's get across here and get Dub some food and get the truck some fuel. Truck smart. They have a 260 gallons what I'm paying right now, guys. It was 445 a gallon back then. So the listed price is 359. So we are saving a dollar a gallon. Is there a left turn here? I'm not 100%. That car is made a left. Does not say no left turn. There's no dedicated turn lane. And we just got a yellow. So let's get over there. Nice little truck stop. And I should probably ask these guys if they can move my shed for it. Because that shed right there is about the same size. Is that barn looking one right there with the windows? Uh, Yeah, you come in right here. All right. That's, I thought you went down further, but there's a scale right there. There is an old uh, line, like a power line truck right there. Okay, let's get in here. Pick up cars and small nozzle. We'll go one next over for that. And we'll see how this process works, guys. But I am glad Truck Smarter told me about it because it just started that first day of the Matt's uh, show at, at Matt's 2023 when we got through on Thursday. So let's get inside. Come on, pretty lady. Yeah, we. Have fun in there. Oh, yeah. When you come back in, I'll do it. Or you pay with court. The truck smarter app? Oh, yeah. It's called for the same suites. That's cool. Yeah, there. Do you mind the tablet or do you not mind the tablet? Do you like it or hate it? Uh, QD, HD. Yeah. MK, that's it. It says Truck Smart right there, too. That's cool. Yeah, so that's Truck Smart, um, what's another, Truckers Path, and then Roadies. It's called three different things. It's three, weird. So they all have their different... Uh, yeah, it's all the same. Okay. Just, yeah. But do they have a different tablet, or are they all working the same one? Same one. Okay, that's cool. How long have you been using Truck Smarter? Um, Pretty, a year, maybe. Maybe a year? Wow. I don't think we... You, it hasn't been long. Not very long. Okay. And then it just turns it on. I can get out there and pump? Yep. yep. Okay, thank you. She wants these things. <laughs> yeah, it's as simple as that, guys. So it's the same tablet that all the other ones are working off, off of. And uh, they've had that for almost a year. I did not know that, Truck Smart. Learn about you every day. Let's get these tanks full at 260 a gallon. What did you get? Oh, I got these little mini things. What the know. heck are those? They're like flavored. That cream in the middle? Yeah. What? I'm excited. I got this, guys. These are my, my childhood. We're filling up for 260 a gallon. Unheard of. So you can buy more things, or we can buy more chrome. Either way, or chrome like your boots. Weren't those boots awesome at Matt's, guys? Things were good. So how do you feel? How do you feel about it? Yeah, not bad? They're creamy? Yeah, try one. I'll try one. Save you one, huh? And I'll give you some of this, because I know you love these. Love them. You hate them. Love them. Yeah, I think they're awesome. When you make them at home, make them with more peanut butter. You know who makes me some of these? Stan, and I love Stan. 
and uh, so, uh, let's fill these things up. Okay, we're up to the brim. Get that thing locked in. There we go, 667.37. Let's see what we actually pay for it. Get in here and uh, get our receipt. Get back on the road. Bad for, for next time? Uh, no, I think you get the points now. I'm okay. just not sure how. Also, send a text to your phone whenever yeah. you get a chance. Just reply yes. They'll okay. give you five extra dollars. Cool. Thank you. That's it. Every time you pump these, we'll just write that card and you'll keep adding points. Okay, I'm adding points. Or I can scan it inside either way. Right here. Okay. Thank All right. Thank you. Thank you. And that is awesome. So I got a. So I'm going to start getting fuel cards for all these little stops too, like uh, Weigels, Weigels and stuff. I have an Ambest. Um, but this is a whole different one for here because if Trucks Motors got it up here, I'm going to be using it. But we just saved $185 on our fill up. So, woo! Go Trucks Motor. Let's get back home. Let's get back at it. Besides that left turn right there, which is a little suspect, that's pretty easy to know. Exit over here and uh, get back on 40. It has a smell or something. Get away from me. It's not geese, it's little white striped birds. We're, we're out of here. Maybe make a nest in a tree next time. Please don't attack us. Where's your friends? And on that note, guys, uh, I guess the the birds don't like T-dubs. The, the geese don't like me. So uh, we're just all over the place. But we're going to hike this mountain right here. Um, <laughs> We, there's a huge median right there, so we parked right there, and uh, we're gonna get some T dubs. I'm gonna edit this video, but yeah, teasing peace for that gentleman from Texas and his Peterbilt man. That fire, I hope. Look at her, she's gone, she's up the mountain. Let's get a little walkway right here. She says, Can I make it up there? Like, you can make it up there, T dubs. But yeah, on that note, $185 saved on $185 saved on fuel is crazy, so I appreciate you, Truck Smarter. Thanks for that dollar give, uh, dollar off, and uh, you guys should do the same. Check it out and get going with Truck Smarter. And on that note, we will see you on the next one. Bye, guys. Bye. What's your names? Greg. Greg? Hi, Greg and Beverly. Nice Greg meeting you guys. Beverly. We're sitting here like, where are you guys from? Just Truck Boys. Take our picture. Of course. Hey, we'll like, no worries. Nice Good. meeting you guys. Nice meeting you. Thank you, man. Awesome. Hey, that was awesome meeting you guys. And I'm glad we came to your restaurant. <laughs> it's good grub.